The Toledo Mud Hens did not have a season last year, but now guess what folks? There's a plan in place for baseball this year. Eric Ibsen, the team's executive vice president and general manager, joining us now live on the air to talk more about that. Eric, just talk right out of the gate about the organization's excitement over the fact that, yeah, we're going to have a season this year. Well, Jeff, I mean, after the, the, the last year that really everybody in the community, whether, whether you have something to do with the mud ends or just what everybody's gone through in their everyday life the last year, to be able to share this news today that there will be a baseball season here at Fifth Third Field. Mud Hen season will start Tuesday, April 6th. Uh, we're just thrilled to be able to share that, announce that. And uh, we got a lot to figure out to get ready to go, but yeah. we're, we're th this is the first step towards progress and, and we're ready to go. Absolutely. Now, there are a lot of new things to talk about as far as how this season is going to kind of flush out. There is an opening week, I understand, Eric? Yeah, our, our approach was because there, there is a capacity, we're, we're looking at 1,500 is the expected capacity for Fifth Third Field when we start in April. And everybody knows how big opening day has become such a tradition here in town. We decided the whole first six game homestand at 1,500 apiece doesn't even quite get us to what opening day normally would be. So because of that capacity and just really a celebration to get the season started after not having one. We're, we're looking at it as not just opening day, but opening days for that first six days uh, with game times to be announced in the very near future. Now, I understand each series, each homestand and road trips, they are a little longer this year. Can you explain that? Sure, they are. Uh, Major League Baseball, who, who created the schedule this year in an attempt to just keep safety in mind uh, for the players, Normally, when you go on a road trip, you're going to two or three cities at a time. The decision was made this year, and it will really be only a 2021 schedule quirk. Uh, and moving forward, it'll go back to, I think, things will look a little bit more normal. But the idea was, instead of having teams travel multiple times within the same trip, if you have a team get to a place where they're going to be playing, have them stay there for six straight days and cut down on some of that travel within the season and within the road trips that happen. So that, that schedule is going to look a little bit different yeah. when you're going to see longer series against the same opponent. Up to six games at a time, I understand. And Eric, I know folks can go online and read more about the changes that will be implemented. Will it be, we've got about 30 seconds, will it be tough to get tickets and where are people going to be allowed to sit and will there be concessions? Lots to figure out there. Social distancing will be in effect. Lots of information will be coming from us to season ticket holders who will really be first in line as we figure out how this inventory is going to work. Normally, we get a schedule about 12 months or a year ahead of time. We've got it six weeks ahead of time. So people are going to be hearing from us quite a bit over the next month or so with all the details about safety, tickets, food and beverage, how everything's going to work. We're just thrilled to get started. All right, so stay tuned for all that great information. But the biggest headline today, obviously, baseball is going to happen downtown once again. Eric Ibsen, general manager for the Mud Hens, thank you so much for spending some time with us and sharing the great news. Thank you so much.